not gonna lie, I'm really starting to realize that I don't know a lot about stuff. Like a lot of these reactions, I really don't know anything about these movies or these games. It's actually kind of sad, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. For this one, I kind of feel like I have a justification only because I feel like Five Nights at Freddy's is before my time, so I really know nothing about it. Don't mind me out here patrolling my yard like I'm fucking Robocop or something. I know Five Nights at Freddy's was a lot popular for kids a lot younger than me. I definitely don't know anything about it. I know it's supposed to be a scary game or something, but, but I ain't gonna lie. I probably wasn't gonna play it anyway, even if I this did come out around my age, but who knows? I guess they got a, I'm assuming a movie or a show, something coming out. So I'm about to see what it's about to be about. I wonder how the kids that actually played this game or how they're going to feel about this movie or show. I'm going to have to see if I could get like my sister, see if she played this game or if she knows someone that played the game, see if they could react to the movie or, or show, whatever this is about to be about. But I'm going to hop straight into this trailer. Don't mind me literally out here sweating my ass off. It is hot, we got some new outdoor furniture, so I'm trying to use and abuse it. But man, it's fucking hot. I got my ass tore up by some mosquitoes. Thank God I put some bug spray on, cause boy, if it wasn't for that bug spray, huh, my ass would've been upstairs. But enough of that, let's get straight into this video. Hi, this is Mike. I was just calling to see if that job that you offered was still available. Yes. And I had to do it from uh, Hunger Games, and I think he's in like uh, Journey to the Center of the Earth. I might have to go look that up. Wait, ain't that Shaggy too? From uh, the OG Scooby-Doo live action? Oh, maybe not, but it damn sure looked just like him. The security guard. I will take anything. This place was huge in the 80s with this wild is uh, by Bloom House. I ain't gonna lie. I feel like they come out with a lot of like actually scary movies. So this might be a little too scary for the kids. <laughs> but I guess the kids that play Five Nights is grown up and at least over 13. So shit, they might enjoy it. The kids, they shut it down years ago. The owner's just not ready to let it go yet. I will work and you will sleep. I understand. Come here, Ed. All you have to do is keep your eyes on the monitor. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's, where fantasy and fun come to life. Okay. You must be a new security guard. Can I uh, help you, officer? Have you met them yet? Met who? Them. I ain't gonna lie, so far, it's looking like if Chuck E. Cheese had a horror movie so far. I mean, again, I don't know how the game was or what the hell the game was about. I don't know how you turn this into a game, but hey, they obviously did because they got a whole movie out of it, so good for them. But so far, it's, I think there's a movie with like Nicolas Cage too, and I swear he was in like, I mean, I don't even know what this is called or Chuck E. Cheese is called, but whatever kind of game, gaming store, gaming place, that had like animatronics in it. I feel like that's the movie Nicolas Cage was in. If I know, if I remember what it's called or see what it's called, I'll put it up on the screen. But so far, that's kind of what it's giving me. But I ain't gonna lie, I never saw that movie, so I don't even know what the hell I'm talking about. But based on that trailer, that's what this is giving me. In the 80s, kids went missing. The police searched Freddy's top to bottom. Hello? <laughs> They never found them. That's why the place shut down. There are ghost children possessing giant robots. Thanks for the heads up. Technically, they're animatronics. What do they want? They want to make her like them. Bobby! Tell me how to stop them. <laughs> it's too late. Where to? 
Why do I always get the weirdos? Not gonna lie, who the hell is this movie for? I ain't gonna lie, like, what is the target audience of this movie? Because I'm not really seeing it. I don't know. I thought this is too mature for kids, but then it's also kind of giving childish a little, but I don't know. That's just me. If Let me know what you guys think in the comments because uh, I'm a little blinded to the whole audience that they imagined for this movie. But other than that, again, hey, I don't know if I'm going to watch it, but it was definitely an interesting trailer. <laughs> it's definitely about to be an interesting movie, to say the least. If you guys enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to see more videos like this, check out that video. But until then, I'm going to catch you guys in that video. Peace.